Alright guys, so a few housekeeping rules before we get started. For Marina Cruz and Miho Soka who sent me some awesome letters, because you guys have such a big volume of it, I've decided to move your letters to a separate video for next month. Um, I hope you guys understand, I just wanted to give you guys proper justice without having to constrain for time, because you know the attention span of YouTube, right? So yeah, other than that, uh, the bigger thing, I know I do not look at the camera in this video, I have never been the best at like reading out things and just showing my face on camera. So I hope you'll forgive me for the constant not looking at it. I decided to do this for all the times I just don't look at the camera. For the person who makes the best joke about it without being too mean because I still have a heart and still human guys. I will post it in the next upcoming video. So yeah, little treats for everybody. Um, that's about it. Let's roll it. <laughs> And hello guys and welcome to another fan mail video! Fan mail video! I am here, Shannon, your anime explorer, your lasagna loving miscreant, and your loving misfit here for some more of these! I have three letters to write right today, so the first one's from Catherine and here we go! Dear Shannon, told ya I write back! Anyway, I loved your my favorite shonen anime video and I have an idea for fan art of you. I like Hunter x Hunter 2, I also like Air Master, it's under the same genre as Shonen, though I don't really see why it's not dubbed. It's so cool, and I can relate to Maki. We are both tall redheads who like to kick ass! I'm the- <clears throat> This clear throat is actually in here. I mean, major ass. I mean, if I could, if I wanted to, but you know, that's how it is. I also enjoy Blue Exorcist, Mob Psycho 100, One Punch Man, Bokuro Hero Academia, Noragami, Cyborg 009, HA! Old school, am I right? And again, those are also in brackets. The power brackets, people. The power brackets. Dragon Ball, but not the arc that shall not be named. To be on- no, side, side story, what is the arc that shall not be named? Everybody tell me in the comments, because I have no idea what that is. I'll figure it out eventually. And more, that would be too damn long to list. Oh, and the Sayuki series. For reasons. Heh. Well, that's it for now. I have some fan art to do. Love for all of the anime, Catherine. And that is really great, Catherine. I love seeing everything you do here. Anyway, on to the next video. Alright, and my second one is from William Crow. Hey, William, I still have all your fan art posted somewhere. I'm going to actually try to put them on my wall at some point. So, um, until then, you'll stay tuned for that. Anyway, dear Shannon, thought I'd write to you and tell you what's going on here new here at- <laughs> Dear Shannon, thought I'd write and tell you what's new here at Eckhart. I honestly can say a lot has happened. About a few weeks back, my brother gave Ozamango Dayo a look-see. I decided to tell him as much as I know about the Slice of Life high school comedy, while trying not to avoid giving him s giving him spoilers. Don't know if he watched it all through the way or not, but he did say that he found it strangely addictive. He's now currently watching Baka and Test or something, and seeing as I hadn't done much animating since making a cartoon I never got a chance to, as I tried to upload it to YouTube and it didn't work out very well, I decided to buy Butterfly Inchworm Animation 2 for my 3DS. It's done wonders for me so far, and I've been getting helpful hints from other users. The one drawback is that I like to use a fair amount of battery using the software. Still, I'm learning a lot, and that's what really counts, and which it does, because me and myself, I was trying to learn Sony Vegas for the longest ass time, and it took me a couple of months, but that's my main that's my mainstay when it comes to editing, because it's a one-time payment, and I refuse to pay the monthly payments of Adobe. Ugh. That and my PC can't potato it all, so... Until I get a better computer, that's what I'm stuck with, but I'm having a fun time as it going. But anyway, back to this letter. Lastly, I tried to participate in the online live streams you guys do, but I always come in late. And we're trying to fix that, I'm trying to have, add a notification so more people can have more time to schedule the live streams in. But, I'm logged into a tablet so YouTube is in mobile mode, which excludes the chat feature for from live streams which is still highly unfortunate. 
Well, I had better sign off for now and sleep in. Been up all night with the animation software. Plus, I just felt like it was trying to sleep in a sauna. Later, William Crow. Ah, oh, now that is some good follow-up, William. I'm happy to hear that. So let's get on to our last letter for today. We're going to make this short. All right, and our last letter is here from Robert Woolstein. You, you've probably heard him around for, from a lot of the reviews we've done over on Patreon. And again, I'm going to make this little addendum here. No, we do not um, solely do reviews from our Patreon reviewers. How our Patreon works, again, is that they get first priority if they have a higher, if they're they pay to a higher tier and then and then all other reviews be will be via what a lot of people want in the comment section or what we personally want to review so i know i'm saying this for the umpteenth time but at least i feel like some of you still have questions about that so that's your answer anyway on to his letter dear shannon congratulations on graduating i hope you and all of the AA crew are doing great I would like to share with you guys a project I'm working on. It's sort of my answer to the lack of diversity in most anime and manga. It's almost ready for release. I have an artist, a backup artist, a writer, and a backup writer. But I still need some marketing. I know you guys are working hard to keep yourselves afloat. But Robin did say that she would like to expand AA and all I ask is for you guys to help me make fans for this. And I'll do the crowdfunding myself. So in the description below, I will have, and probably on the screen, I'll have some some cool ideas for you, some of his pages for you guys all to see. They're really great for the pilot. But anywho, it's a shonen style manga or comic. But I understand if you guys can't, and I won't hold it against you, and will still be a strong Patreon supporter. Well, that wasn't that was in retrospect. I just said what I just said. So. And thank you for reviewing and liking Kiss Him Not Me. I like this show because Kai reminds me of my girlfriend. She loves the ship too. Steve and Bucky forever! And I have no idea what that ship is, but someone will remind me in the comments. Hopefully. As a thank you, I asked my artist Venetia to do a fan art of you. I hope you like it. I also wanted Sumi to hump your leg, but I guess that's too much to ask. If you do and decide to help me out, then I'll ask her to do the rest of the crew. I would be honored if you would do a review of my... Not a review. What's this? This is not a review. Ahem. I would be honored if you would do an interview of my main characters, Karasu, Mura, and Ronin. You can ask each of them one question and they will act accordingly. It would be like the three Yokomas of four panel manga that I also have no idea what that is. So I'll probably figure that out. My future me will probably figure that out. I'll pray that you like my burn of DVDs and look forward to seeing that review. I hope all good things for you and you guys here in the future. So stay strong, Robert. Oh, that was nice. That was a good one. So yeah, I'm just going to end it off here now. I'll probably go get some lunch because lunch is important. So follow me on my Twitter for any letters or fan mail because starting the next video, I will be looking on Twitter for questions involving those. Also, um, I'm still looking for more people to promote, to promote for Community Corner for these next two, um, videos for Burn Up and the Top Ten. And I just want, and I decided to do that, um, Community Corner because I thought it was, like, a good way to, like, introduce other people to other things in the community. Yeah, they might not be the best, they might not be the best commercialized, and I'm not really looking for, like, things that are, like, super super mainstream and important it's just if you're a person who has a passion for anime whether you're you're, you're on deviant art you're writing stuff on fan fiction maybe on youtube if you're another fellow youtuber and you're just wanting to get some shout outs then i will be happy to oblige because we all love anime in this crazy bowl of ramen land so yeah so until next time tip your waitresses and everything else i say because i forgot and so stay tuned, Anime America. Bye. Want to support the production? Check out our brand new store on Store Envy. For a small price, you can have a one-of-a-kind poster made by yours truly. If you can only give a small amount to help us out, check out our Patreon page. Any amount you wish to give us goes towards our production needs. So anything you can give us helps us a lot. To keep up with the latest in Anime America stuff, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Tumblr.
Be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe to Anime America for more awesome reviews and top 10 lists. If you're interested in anything of pop culture, be sure to subscribe to Pop Spectrum. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned to Anime America.